We opened the cemetery gates in 2022. It was the start of a new journey. We didn't go on holiday. We believe the global pandemic is a tipping point. To stay connected and build genuine relationships, we had to be creative, to find new ways to bring people together. Discovering Hidden Gems Cemetery Tour was a local solution. We enjoyed exploring 18 cemeteries that make up the Sunshine Coast Cemetery Network. From small gatherings to collaborative initiatives, there was something for everyone. Storytelling in Wombai Cemetery, a Queensland Heritage Festival activity. Litter picking while supporting Plastic Free July. Dying to Know Day, a simulated burial in Cullingall Lawn Cemetery. And a garden cemetery walk and morning tea celebrating mental health and well-being. We learn that cemeteries are a central public infrastructure that the public has a right to access and use. Cemeteries are more than an archive of colonial and family history. They are places of cultural heritage where citizens can practice and maintain cultural rituals and ceremonies. A new choice became available during the year, natural burials on a site within Umundi Cemetery. Sunshine Coast Regional Council has made a promising start in acknowledging how people appropriately farewell a loved one, including respecting secular and religious beliefs. However, there is more to do to ensure access to culturally respectful services is available to benefit the whole region. Public interest, support and participation during 2022 have been strong, a clear indication we are ready. On Sunday, December the 25th, gifting hundreds of flowers and morning tea in Cullingore Lawn Cemetery signifies love, hope, cooperation and commitment. Together, we can support each other, learn and improve the experience of dying and death in a community way.